But anyway, this is the third scene, I believe. The third part of stage 36. And that is checkpoint 15. Off so you don't have to re-trigger it if you're not out. That's that's hard. Now I believe you want to stand under the blade as a reference point. Actually you don't need to. Yeah. This place seems familiar. Oh great. So originally uh, I was going to make a Undertale like battle where you uh, control as Hugo, but uh, I ended up uh, getting too lazy to build that so so I, I removed that completely and here we are. Now I believe you should not jump because there is a hidden blade on top. Yeah. <laughs> what in the what happened here? Have you been here before? Yep. I know quite a few parts of Sir Freddy's mines. What is this place? Why is it so trashed? It was supposed to be a gallery of sort? I don't know what happened either. Oh yeah, if you haven't seen uh, the gallery in uh, uh, Shapeshifting Adventure 1, well, here's the gallery. <laughs> yeah, a durian. Uh, so some, I think a some some place in Singapore. Uh, they tape a durian onto a wall onto a wall, just a reference uh, as a parody of a the banana tape onto the onto the wall, which is really ridiculous. Who would buy one hundred and twenty thousand dollars for that? 
I like this Mona Lisa art. Yeah, uh, some screenshot from Castlevania Symphony of the Night. That's an Easter egg, why not? Checkpoint! Now, this place seems familiar, isn't it? <laughs> <coughs> yeah, I actually made it e easier. Because uh, I wasn't planning on making Shape Shifting Adventure 2 as hard as the first one, so yeah. Now you can go here, but I don't I don't think this is really necessary. Uh there's a lone Rubin over there, but you don't you don't need to do anything to it. Now you have to go back and you, you can't walk here because there are hidden there's a hidden blade over here that prevents access. So yeah. Oh. Okay, never mind. That worked out, I guess. Proceed to the Quartz Gallery. Uh, so I want to talk about these images a little bit. Uh, this is uh, the from Rubithid, you know, the dungeon game. And then this is uh, from, well, I don't... This is obviously, uh, you know, it's obvious. Now I believe uh, in... Oh wait, whoops. That painting has... Uh, I can't remember what that painting is. <coughs> oh yeah, the Moon Lord. Uh, this is the Land of Benediction. Uh, what is it called? The, the Peace Score, whatever. This is a picture of me, actually. This is from Rubithid, and I guess that's it. There were supposed to be coins up here, but I guess they were they were raided. <laughs> Come back to Papa.
Wait, I don't think there's anything on the left side. Yeah, it's just a uh, cold door. Another checkpoint. I believe uh, there's nothing on the right either. Yeah, it's just another gold, uh, chunk of gold ore. Gold ore everywhere. Don't you just love it? A cow. Cow. There. Damn, son. If you walk down this path, uh, it basically just says that, um, haha, stupid, something like that. Yeah, uh, uh, the proof that there is, there is something dangerous down here, Alucard just transformed into a bat. Uh, he'll do that if, he, if there's something dangerous be below him. Uh, that's a fake checkpoint. Basically, it just knocks you out. In so in Ship Shifting Adventure One, like these platforms, they move, but over here, it, they don't. They don't. everywhere oh, great. oh does this clown doesn't attack us from the left please go away clown Oh. Okay, I, I guess that works out. Worked out as well. Stupid clown, man. Yeah, I, I I do find the clown annoying myself. So yeah, you're not alone. Checkpoint number eighteen. Come on, why is it so slow?
Wow, why do I have to wait for this platform? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Basically, this happens.